Hey you guys, Wayne here from H2 Tech Videos. Today I want to show you how to set up your DigiLand 10 inch quad core tablet. And first thing we're going to do is we're going to select the language you want it to be in. And um, I'm going to go by default and put it on English. And hit the yellow button. And next you're going to connect to your Wi-Fi network, which is your wireless internet. Uh, so you want to find the name of whatever your Wi-Fi network is. Mine is Team Rain. And then you're going to input your password. Once you have your password in, go ahead and tap connect. There we go. We're connected. Now, if you had trouble finding that number or whatever the password or pass key is, um, sometimes it's on the back of your router. The router is your wireless internet box. That's the box that gives you or makes the internet wireless. So if you can't find it, go to that box and you should see... Uh, like a, a number on there, like a nine or ten digit number, uh, eight usually eight ten digits, and that would be your um, the number for the Wi-Fi. So keep that in mind. Um, now you're gonna put in your uh, Gmail account and your password. If you don't have one, you're gonna tap create a new account. But if you do have a Gmail, you're gonna go ahead and enter it right here. So just tap where it says enter your email. Tap right there, and then you're gonna put in your email address. And let me input mine. If you hold down on this top row, then you can just uh, input a number instead of having to switch by tapping here. So that's kind of cool. Just a little shortcut right there. Um, but there wasn't supposed to be a two there, so I don't know why I did that. Committed to victory. And add symbols right here. You don't have to put it in the at gmail.com, but I always do it anyway. Um, and then down here is .com. And then you're going to input, you're going to hit next right here. And then it will ask for your password. All right, once you've entered your password, go ahead and tap next. And then hit accept. And give it a couple of seconds to verify the information. And what it's going to also do is check to see if you have any old apps or anything you've purchased from Google before and it will uh, help you get access to those things so just takes a couple of maybe like up to 30 mm -hmm. seconds and there it is we're done that fast it's gonna ask you to add a credit card uh, I would just tap remind me later and hit next and it's gonna take a few more seconds continue to set up certain things but we'll be at our home screen very soon so There we go. Now it's going to ask you if you want to set a, a password for your lock screen so when you turn on the tablet, someone has to put a password in before you get in it. Uh, if you do want to do that, go ahead and hit set screen lock now. I'm going to choose not to put a password on mine. I'm just going to skip to the next thing by tapping skip. And then we're going to hit skip anyway. And hit more. Next. If it ever lets you hit it, because it may not. And then if it doesn't, you can't hit it. Perfect. And there we are. Now we're officially on our home screen. And that was it, guys. Hope you found this helpful. Make sure you like, favorite, and share if it was helpful. Subscribe to HG Tech Videos. And in our next video, we're going to show you how to use this tablet. Do just a basic beginner walkthrough. So definitely keep an eye out for that. And thanks for watching.